I started noticing my hair loss uh, probably in my late 20s, early 30s. Um, something that I started noticing when I'd go to the mirror and um, didn't really like it. My self-image at the time was uh, diminishing and it started stressing me out. I started feeling more depressed and those just uh, seemed to exacerbate the problem. I'm in my 30s. Um, I'm taking oral finasteride. It's helping, but it's not solving the problem. And I was looking for a more permanent solution. So I started looking into um, hair transplants, things of that nature. My preconceived uh, impression of hair transplants was a, a negative stigmatization, kind of an embarrassing type of thing to do, and also a terrifying thing to do. Uh, at the time, uh, the only thing that was available was a FUT transplantation. It's where they, you know, they cut into the back of your head, and it just seemed like a terrifying, you know, surgical procedure that uh, I was kind of scared. I was terrified to do it. I didn't want to do that. It seemed like the writing was on the wall. Um, uh, my hair kept thinning. I felt like I was going to go bald, so I had to make a choice. So I did decide that I, I was going to go ahead and, and take the plunge and get a hair transplant. So I'm up late night and searching uh, the internet and I come across Alvi Armani and the results looked incredible. Uh, the results uh, that I saw from other testimonials just looked really, really awesome. Way better than the other sites that I had checked out. So I decided to uh, call and get a consultation. So I came in for my consultations. He took a look at my hair and showed me the problem areas up close and personal and gave me his recommendations, which was pretty much what I was already thinking to begin with. So uh, yeah, I decided to, uh, I chose Alvi Armani. For the pre-surgical planning, um, when I came in, I was a little nervous just because you see these kind of horror stories online, you know, people not getting the results that they wanted. But um, when I came in and talked to the doctor and I voiced those concerns, he really, you know, listened and took everything I said into account. You know, for me personally, I was having a recession here up front and I didn't want like any like pronounced V. I wanted it to look very, very natural, not not oversaturated. And uh, those were the concerns that I brought to the doctor and he took all of it into account. The procedure itself, everybody, the whole staff was very accommodating. After uh, we spoke with the doctor, we got into the uh, operating room. And it's very non-invasive. Uh, after uh, you get a shot of uh, anesthesia, spoke with the staff and, uh, you know, just kind of did my thing and let them do theirs. My post-op experience, once everything was said and done, I went back home. There's a lot of things you have to do as far as, you know, taking care of uh, the area. Kind of tedious, but at the same time, totally worth it. I mean, come on now. I mean, the FUE uh, experience compared to the FUT is just, you know, a total step above. For me personally, uh, I've always tried to be very preventative maintenance from the get-go. I didn't let the problem get too bad or too noticeable before I took action. You know, taking action early is, is the best thing to do. And uh, for me, I think people didn't really notice that I had a procedure done. They just noticed that, you know, wow. This guy looks great. He looks enhanced. He's really taking care of himself. Now, I can't wait to wake up and go take a look in the mirror and see my beautiful hair, my beautiful face, and beautiful results. A lot of things I do um, depend on my appearance and my confidence. Um, when I look great, I feel great. And um, I want to project positivity in the world. When I'm depressed, when I don't feel good about myself, I, I, I project a more negative. And I, I want to be a positive guy. I want to feel great. I want to wake up bright-eyed and bushy-tailed and ready to go. Since I've come to Alvi Armani, my self-esteem and my self-confidence has gone through the roof.